made it, we made it, we made it, we got the job, we got the job. good welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if you guys are new here my name is santos don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so good afternoon friends it is the yes it is the middle of the afternoon um i got carried away with cleaning and hanging out with mama firecracker i was like listen girlfriend i need to go so that way i can make sure that this house is prepared for the week because uh homeboy has a lot of work going on this week okay um so today is sunday february 4th so firstly shout outs to all of my aquariuses we are in aquarius season hard y'all we are in it y'all have y'all been seeing the Aquarius' meme all over uh, Instagram? They are eating us up, okay? But I'm not even gonna hold you. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, half of them be true. They be dead on, okay? I'm gonna actually get into some skincare, y'all, while I catch you guys up because we got a lot to, to catch up with. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get into my fresh 
deep hydrating uh, rose turner. If you guys know, you know this stuff is legit, okay? Um, I'm gonna need fresh to put me on the PR list, okay? I have some amazing news for you guys. I wanna go ahead and tell you guys that if you guys have been riding with me since day one, thank you guys so much because without your support, without your views, without you sharing my work, I would have never gotten recognized. For a long time, this was a hobby for me for almost two years, y'all. Like, two and a half years. And there's been many times where I wanted to quit because I didn't feel like I belonged, you know? I felt like I was not worthy. And, you know, thank God I have an amazing best friend. And I have a lot of supporters that truly believe in my work and saw the potential and reminded me every time that keep going, you know? And y'all... I'm gonna tell you that last couple of weeks wasn't the, the easiest, okay? Two weeks ago, I was hospitalized. Um, if you guys saw my last vlog, um, I did let you guys know that I did get food poisoning, which caused um, other issues. But then I was feeling better for a couple of days and I was able to close out that vlog. But shortly after, maybe a day after, y'all, I got so sick, so sick. And that led me to be hospitalized. And when I tell you, it was not fun. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, use the Sunday Riley Vitamin C Serum. Um, this one smells amazing. If you guys haven't tried this, this is so good. Um, I love the texture and I love the um, actual hydration that it provides and the actual um, glow that it provides. It just looks... Yeah, my skin really looks good. I'm not going to hold you. But going back to, you know, being hospitalized, I was in the hospital for uh nine days and it was mentally exhausting um my best friend really held me down she i mean she's not in the state but she was on the phone with me every day you know trying to keep me sane and i don't really have nobody to vouch for me you know mama firecracker can't do much for me and being in a hospital bed for nine to ten days uh, i was there for ten days um can be mentally exhausting so the day I left the hospital, y'all, I had to go to church because I just felt so alone. Um, I'm using the Glow Recipe Watermelon Dew Drops um, as a second serum. I love how this gives me an overall glow and it just makeup just glides on to this. Ugh, but look at, look guys, y'all get into the glow. Stop playing. I mean, ugh, love Glow Recipe. <laughs> After I went to the church, um, I'll insert a, a photo, y'all. I never felt so alone ever in my life. Like, I really felt very sad that I just went to the church. I just sat there and asked God to give me a message, like to show me the way because I was like, this is too much, it's too much. I like purged everything that I needed to and y'all, let me tell you, believe in God, believe in, in you know, your higher power, give, give it to him. Give him the hurt he understands. I asked for a sign. I want to say two hours after I left that church, y'all, I got amazing news. And this is what I want to share with you guys. Even though I went through hell and back for those 10 days, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. And God showed me this is what I need to be doing. One brand um, hit me up asking if they can go ahead and use one of my videos that I created for them, not knowing that they, that that video even got seen by them. They are asking to run it so I can get exposure and I'm just so happy. So I'll be featured in their Instagram shop. So when you go to the category of blushes, that's where I will be. It's gonna be amazing exposure. Um, and honestly, it's one of my videos that are more creative, but I literally love the blush. So I'm glad that it's a genuine review. Um, and it's from a, a company that I really like. Just great news. And it doesn't stop there. Um, so the moisturizer that I am using is the Ulla Henderson uh, Triple uh, Strength Training uh, Peptide Moisturizer. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, my mom's home attendant is very loud. <laughs> uh, my skin is skinning. Okay, can y'all get into the skin? Oof, oof. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to get into some makeup as well, but I'm trying to tell you guys everything before I forget. This moment is for you guys that held on, that has been, that has believed in me. We have signed a, our first contract, so we are no longer amateurs. I'm working with L'Oreal, y'all. They found me and reached out and applauded me for my content, okay? 
when I tell you, I mean, to some that might be such a little thing, but for somebody like me, for them to be viewing my, my artistry and loving it and want to create with me, I'm just like, oh my God. So we are officially signed. So I will be creating um, some stuff with them, which I'm very, very excited. I got my first PR package on its way. Guys, who would have thought I'm getting a PR package? Well, I have a PR package here too. <laughs> Do you understand? Like, we're actually working influencers. I mean, I don't like the word influence, but that does come with the territory. That's why we're here. But guys, we've come a long way. And that's why I try to encourage the smaller influencers or people even that are bigger than me that are not growing as fast. You have to remember why you came on here. And that's why I always remind myself when it gets tough that I came on here because I just wanted to show my creativity or my personality. Um, I wanted to do something bigger than you know, what was in front of me. Because of you guys, we are now officially working creators. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm grateful to God. I'm grateful for you guys and continue to spread the word because now it's a new chapter and this one is for you guys. We're about to go full for Legends to this. So stay tuned. I'm actually going to use a new primer. I'm gonna use the new one size Secure the Blur Primer. Um, I actually picked this up a couple of days ago. Um, so here's the packaging, it's, it's more of a hydrating primer, that's why the top is blue. I love, love the packaging, okay? I'm gonna need uh, one size to send me some PR because I am such a huge fan and I've put so many people on, but this is what the bottle looks like. It has these, um, what are they called, boba beads? This is so cute. Just alone the packaging, I will just display it because it's so cute. One size. One, size. One size, put me on the PR yeah, list, PR okay? PR. But no, I'm gonna actually take two pumps of this. So there you go, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. It feels nice. Oh my God, it feels like water. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my God, this feels really, really nice. Um, it says it's a tacky primer on the box, but to me, this feels very, very silky. You know me, I keeps it a buck, y'all. I definitely keeps it a buck. Um, this don't feel tacky to me. Maybe it has to set, like sit on the skin. All right, I'm actually gonna give this a second because look, y'all, I don't, I don't feel no, no stickiness. It actually feels very like, like a, like a, a mask, like a hydrating mask, but I don't feel it sticky. Oh, is it me? Look, guys. I don't... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Okay, it has a little bit of, like, a suction feel to it, but it's not like the grip primer. The grip primer, actually, like, your fingers go like that on the skin. So, all right, let's keep going. Let's see how um, the foundation and everything else lays on. Now let's go ahead and color correct. Um, so I also want to talk to you guys about making my way back into the cosmetics industry, guys. So with all of the excitement news, it doesn't stop there. I'm telling you, like, this year is insane. I don't know. I created my mood board and I, it has just been up there. Literally everything that I've put on that thing is happening and I'm just, I'm, 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 I literally am scaring myself. It's so crazy to me, guys. Um, manifestation is real. It truly is. You just have to put the work in. So um, I'm going ahead firstly with my color corrector. This is the Lancome color corrector. I think this one is discontinued because I don't ever see it in the stores, but this is not a makeup tutorial, so I don't have to use all the latest and greatest, okay? <laughs> I am also interviewing for a huge makeup company at a point in my life where if I'm not enjoying what I do, I don't wanna do it. Even if it's for a paycheck, um, of course, we're responsible adults, but what I'm saying is that I'm not motivated to do something that is not in this field of cosmetic. Doing campaigns, uh, doing anything, doing artistry, uh, reviewing, like anything in the cosmetics field I need to be a part of. I'm, I, there's nothing else that in interests me, especially now that I'm doing makeup on this level. My production, content they're on a professional level and i'm like i can't go back to like just the regular field and just be doing regular makeup you know that just doesn't fulfill me so i'm gonna continue working out you know all the kinks to continue growing on here had my interview on friday 
Um, and I definitely nailed that, that interview. So I have a follow-up uh, interview tomorrow with um, the regional manager. Um, I think this is the person that's going to hire me. Um, so I'm claiming that, you know, I'm getting hired. Um, I'm definitely confident um, in the work that I put out. And I, this company is a huge company. You guys will be surprised who I'm interviewing with. I don't want to you know get ahead of myself i want to be able to say that i got the job because i don't want to you know also be disappointed if i don't but even if i don't um i asked god for a sign and literally he gave me all that i needed so i know that i'm on the right track guys so yes all exciting news also i want to thank all of you guys that take the time to head over to my instagram and dm me and have chit chats with me because first of all I hear you guys. I hear you. I hear you about the vlogs. I didn't know I would become like a real vlogger, but I know that you guys are actually enjoying it. You, this is the second most um, requested videos now on my channel. The people that watch it, the, the view time is so long. So that's what truly saves my channel. We're growing, we're growing, we're growing, especially with what's happening right now. So I'm telling you guys, we are about to do it up. Also, um, it's my birthday, like I mentioned earlier. Um, in two days right four five six seven on no, three days my birthday is february 7th um so i did um i did equipment upgrading y'all um i am whew, very stoked about the equipment upgrade um we will talk about that later we also have um a couple of boxes i don't know if i already mentioned that um we'll do a little collective haul or an unboxing later um i also have pr and i also got a package from my best friend so i haven't opened it because i wanted to open it with you guys for foundation i'm going to use the nars light reflecting foundation one of my favorites um i don't want to do a heavy beat today so i'm just keeping it very very light and i put a lot of effort into my channel i spend a lot of money for my channel because I want to continue to grow as a videographer. I also want to grow on my channel and you know these equipment um, upgrades have allowed me to express myself and be creative as I like. You know um, the new camera is right here. This is the new camera. Again y'all not ready for what's to come i'm really really excited anyways guys i'm gonna go ahead and finish up my makeup i'm gonna let oh excuse me i'm gonna let it play um and then i will see you guys in the car no one looks like you, no one walks that way And I say, ooh, bye, what's your name? If I lose, I lose, I'll get you someday That's so it's fire, that's so it's fire so unfortunately i wasn't able to make it outside today um because mama firecracker is not feeling good so i asked her what i could do or if she was hungry she said she was so i ordered some chinese food for her um so i'm just waiting on that order but no worries um i'll go pick up the stuff uh later in the week and i'll bring you guys with me so no worries shit happens um you know this is real life and 
You know, like I said, I do have limitations because I do take care of my mother and there are moments like this where, you know, I have to sacrifice. I don't mind it, but it is my reality, you know, so. <laughs> but anyways, we still have um, a couple of things. Um, like I said earlier, I have um, a couple of packages here. So I have a little bit of a um, collective haul. Um, like I said earlier, well, I don't remember exactly what I said or where I left off. But um, I do have some, um, I have a PR package there. Um, I have some equipment upgrades here um, that we'll talk about later. Um, and I got an Amazon, I got two Amazon packages and what is that a, a paper shredder because y'all like this is out of control like literally the stacks of it's a mess the stack of letters just just like the amount so because again it's it's me taking care of my mom the over consumption of paperwork when people get older it's just like all of that is junk it's literally junk 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 i'm like all my bills come out automatically so why are you guys sending me paper and then the rest of it is just all bullshit for uh health insurance i swear the united states has to have the biggest insurance scam <laughs> but anyways guys let me um grab my mom's food and as soon as i do that we'll go ahead and start this unboxing all right, y'all, so I just finished with my mother cleaning up the house and stuff. She is in bed, so now I can attend to you guys. Uh, today was just such a waste of a day. I'm like, ah, I wanted to get some stuff done, but it's all right, shit happens. Um, so right now I'm exporting all of the footage from today um, onto the computer so I can start editing this video. Um, I'm not gonna hold you guys. I am exhausted. I, that Chinese food me and my mother ate together and it gave me the itis. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I wanna go to sleep. But I want to um, show you guys what I got here uh, so that way I can get into some skincare and get in bed, okay? Let's get into some of the packages I have here. So actually, let me start with, off with this big one. Um, this was, I don't know exactly what's in this box, that kind of is annoying, but I don't know what's in this box, give me a second, okay, oh, so this is my up, uh, upgraded equipment, so this, I'll show you guys in a second, this is a, I don't know what you call this, a tabletop stand, so this I'm going to be able to clip it onto here, uh, so that way I can actually put like the vlogging camera up and move it around um, and also I can do uh, my nail video top down view so yes we got one of those um, I'm really really excited because you guys know I take my content serious so I'm going to grab this alright so this is the next thing that I picked up okay so this is um, a ND filter from the brand Nisi. So um, on the new vlogging camera, it doesn't come with an ND filter like the Sony ZV-1, like this camera that we're recording on now. So I needed to make sure when I'm outside that I don't get overexposure because I do not have time, especially if I'm putting all this money into it. Okay, so um, I picked up these, this 48 uh, count battery pack. These are double A. I bought these uh, for all of my uh, fairy lights behind me. Uh, I have three sets, and honestly, guys, when the batteries start to die, the it doesn't give that same, like, bulk of balls that I like, so I'm just trying to keep them always as, you know, as lit as possible, so I did purchase that for this, um, and I guess we can talk about the equipment upgrades, because I'm sure that's what you guys all love or want to know. <laughs> I'm sure I'm going to get the question, why... Am I upgrading? I did um, invest in and upgrade um, my vlogging setup. My vlogging setup is amazing and everything, but there is um, quality that it lacks. Like, I know it's strengths or it's limitations. I don't want to say weaknesses, it's limitations. Um, and I've mastered this camera and I truly love this camera and this camera is not going anywhere. This is now my official B-roll camera. This will always be in support of the new camera. 
um, and it just makes it a lot easier to match footage to the new vlogging camera so I love that I wanted better quality and I also wanted a very cinematic um, effect especially now that I am more into filmmaking and I am very particular when it comes to framing long and hard did research for months and I felt uh, decided to upgrade to the a6700 so this is what the box looks like this camera is a bigger setup okay so that's also why I'm not getting rid of my Sony uh, ZV-1 because it is not a camera that is a running gun you know this is a camera that I do have to plan to use um, because it's just absolutely no way um, I'm just gonna run and gun with that camera, but let me show you guys the new camera So here is the new 6700 y'all get into this bad boy, okay? Um, I do love that it is very lightweight. I do like that um, It's just obviously bigger, but the quality that comes out of this camera. I am impressed Okay, like the stabilization on this camera when I walk with it. It's perfect. I am leveling up my content um, You guys know I'm very very much excited to continue growing here on this platform and making Very very cinematic vlogs for you guys to enjoy I love to submerge you guys into it and that's why I've invested in the channel and myself and you guys, you know, because you guys truly motivate me to continue to create. So that's that for gear. If you guys have any questions, do thumbs off. Um, you guys know I like to educate as much as possible. There's not going to be a lot of the footage from the new camera in this vlog, but most definitely for the next vlog, we're going to start filming on that. I did get a PR package um i need to cover this information before i open the big box um i did pick up a shredder uh because yeah we need one so i did pick this one up from best buy listen y'all a, a good shredder is so hard to find why why that last shredder literally i think i paid 40 dollars for it and y'all it couldn't it just no. It didn't shred more than like three pieces of paper at a time. And then when you would shred the paper or enough paper, it will get too hot. And then you will have to wait for it to cool down. So this is from my best friend. If you guys don't know who my best friend is, she's the beautiful and talented Tata Nisha here on uh, YouTube as well as on all social media platforms. Um, she sent me this package for my birthday. Of course, she has a card here. I'm not going to read this because I know it's going to make me cry because she just is an amazing person and she knows my heart. So I don't want to read I don't want to cry. I don't want to cry. So I'm going to put this aside. But let me go ahead and... Oh my God. Y'all, look. My friend. She is the sweetest. She... Not her sending me all the goods. Send me um, one size powder puff, the Lola's um, forget the filler lip glosses. I've been seeing this all over social media. I'm really excited to try these shadow palettes. So I did. She sent me the Born This Way, the Natural Nudes palette. Actually, you know, I don't even have a really good nude palette because y'all know me. I love me some color. So maybe I'll pop these out for a future tutorial. I know, I know guys, I've been slacking on the production videos, but y'all, it takes a lot. But, oh God, y'all, look at how beautiful this palette is. Ooh, okay. Definitely doing um, a look with this. This is really, really pretty. Actually, I should probably use this for my birthday palette. Ooh. Oh, I got lip pencils. Um, she sent me the Lip Injection Extreme Lip Pencils in Cinnamon Swirl and Big... Um, in big truffle okay she also sent me a matter of fact their moisturizer I just saw this in um, Sephora the other day this is like y'all I need this I need this it is the maximalist age defining a moisturizer 
I'm using this tonight. Stop playing. I got the Better Than Sex mascara. Um, I did get a 24-hour brow setter. Here, <gasps> she sent me Dominique Cosmetics brow pencil. I've been wanting to try this. Thanks, friend. She knows I love oil, so I'm gonna try this. I'm actually gonna try this tonight. The Specifica Glow Baby uh, Boost Serum. Mm. This looks promising. I love Love's oils. Okay, we got some good stuff. Too Faced Moon Crush. Is this a highlighter from Too Faced? Oh, look at this packaging. Oh, this packaging is so cute. And let's see what it looks like. Oh, how stunning. Look at how beautiful. That is so pretty. Very, very pretty. Oh, this is the Milk Lip Oil Gloss in Soul Searcher. Shut up. Shut up. This is pretty. Mm-hmm. Oh, and it smells good. A lip oil gloss. Mm -hmm. This is so nice. Mm. This I'm putting to the side. My friend sent me. I'm trying to. I'm trying to be like. Ugh! I'm trying to be professional, guys. I'm trying to be professional, but I have to open this one with you guys because I've been wanting a blush palette for a little bit. And hello, my friend came through. My friend came through. I love her so much. Oh my god, look! Stop it. Look at how stunning. Oh my god. I am feeling this whole entire row. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to use this. I can't wait to use this. I want to put this on right now. Thank you. And then she sent me the Rare Beauty. What is this? Oh my god, she sent me so much stuff. First of all, this bag is so cute. She sent me beauty blenders. Oh my god, friend. Friend, friend, friend. Thank you so much for this beautiful gift. Thank you for believing in my dreams. Thank you for seeing the potential. And thank you for reminding me of my worth. I truly love you. I truly do. I know the world only sees you for your talents, but if I could tell the world something about you is that you truly are an amazing friend and an amazing soul and the prayer that I've been asking for, for all my life. So thank you, friend, for just being a friend. I love you so much. Thank you for making my uh, birthdays always special. <laughs> Guys, I could go on and on about her. I love her so much. I'm going to hop in the shower and I'm going to call it a night. Um, I will catch you guys tomorrow. Later, guys. What's up, y'all? Good afternoon. It is the next day. So it is February 5th. Um, I'm actually um, getting ready to head to work. Um, well, I'm actually here, but I'm in the car. I was like, let me go ahead and update you guys. Um, so... Um, this morning, I was like, uh, let me go ahead and run to the post office because I did get a little um, notification package in the, a notification slip in the mailbox. So I was like, okay. So I went to get it and oh my God, my best friend sent me a package. My other best friend. I, I, I wasn't expecting that, like just so sweet so thank you Cheyenne if you guys don't know who she is I'm gonna go ahead and put her uh, Instagram here uh, she also is a beauty influencer here on uh, YouTube so I'll go ahead and put all of her handles down in the description bar thank you so much Shay. oh my god thank you thank you thank you oh my gosh I am just like you guys spoil me. You truly do. Um, I'm just so grateful. So anyways, I'm not going to talk you guys up too much. Um, I also wanted to let you guys know I did go to Home Depot. Um, I didn't film. Uh, I just wanted to see if they had the Nathan James in there. And of course they didn't. Um, I did go on the website and it said available for order. So I guess I'm just going to place the order on my lunch break for the shelves. And then we'll just build it together um, in the next vlog. So... Um, what else? Is there anything else I need to update you guys on? I thought I told you guys yesterday at, that I had my interview today, y'all. Why I went into the um, Zoom meeting and nobody was there? I was like, did I like read this email wrong? And I sure did. 
the interview is actually for tomorrow um so the lady texted me she was like um diana her name is diana i don't want to say the lady diana texted me i mean not text me she emailed me and she was like oh i saw you popped onto the portal she was like just wanted to let you know it's for tomorrow i was like oh I was like, I'm so sorry. I'm like, listen, I'm on time, baby. A day on time. Okay. <laughs> I'm showing them that I truly, truly want this job. So, yeah, guys, that's all the updates. So, I'm going to get my ass into work. Um, this is the first time I'm actually going to work with makeup on. But, y'all, that freaking one-size primer got my skin looking like butter. I haven't seen my skin look this good in a long time. Oh, my gosh. I really am loving it. Um yeah my skin is giving buttery and i'm so here for it oh my gosh i i definitely am going to do an updated uh foundation routine because the skin has been skinning anyways guys let me get out of here i'll see you guys in i don't know if i'm gonna pick up the camera for the rest of the day but if i do i'll see you guys well anyway i'll see you guys later what's up everyone good morning good morning today is the, the day of the sixth and y'all Yo, we made it! We made it! We made it! We got the job! We got the job! I'm officially a Fenty Beauty uh, associate. I am now officially hired with Fenty Beauty. Um, I have a few territories now in New York, and I'm just... <sighs> I was trying to keep this a secret. Um, I tried to really, really explain to you guys without explaining, like, <sighs> oh my gosh, I'm, I am, I'm sorry guys, it's a little dark on this side. I'm like lost to full words. Um, I'm very, very excited for this chapter. I've been praying so hard, so, 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 so hard. Um, I just got off um, the interview. Um, I thought it was yesterday, but um, it wasn't, so. Whew, I'm just I'm, I'm I'm ecstatic and I'm blessed <clears throat> I've been asking for uh, change for a while and I've been miserable I've been, but I've been like going through the punches and God knows that I've taken a lot of beatings um, with this last job and I'm just like I'm not happy my heart really truly belongs in cosmetics i just love everything about cosmetics whether it's the creativity part whether servicing clients whether it's just uh, uh production uh formulas like the science that goes behind makeup is so complex and hence why i love it because i'm such a geek <laughs> but yes guys we are the new fenty beauty advisor so yeah we're back officially in the industry and i'm just like i can't believe i can't believe i can't believe it i can't believe it yes guys things are happening things are so happening i just finished the interview um everything went well so i did get the offer so now i'm just gonna go ahead and take all of the stuff off i had to pull uh my ysl blazer and my uh express shirt because i had to come with the black on the black okay <laughs> but i'm gonna actually um fix my makeup a little bit um so that way i can actually look like something and then we're gonna go outside i got a couple of errands to run remember um i was supposed to run errands the other day um but unfortunately i got caught up because my mom didn't um she wasn't feeling good and then yesterday i couldn't do much uh because i had to go uh to the corporate job which i didn't leave until y'all yesterday i've been waking up since i've left the hospital um, I've been waking up around like 7 o'clock in the morning, sometimes a little bit before. And yesterday was such a long day because I woke up at 7, no, I woke up at 6 something in the morning. And then I had to get ready for uh, my interview, which I thought was yesterday, which it wasn't. But I still got up and got ready. And then I had to, um, I went to home, to home Depot and they didn't have what I wanted. So I wound up ordering uh, the Nathan James furniture. Um, I ordered uh, the shelves um, and, oh, well, the, the ladder shelf and then another like wall shelf. Uh, so that's coming in. I actually, <clears throat> let me see if I can find the receipt really quickly. Um, I'm very, very excited for this order because I definitely need a little bit more storage in this room because it's, it's truly getting out. I know I said that, I mentioned that earlier before, but let me see if I can find the receipt so that I can show you guys what it is. All right, guys, so here is the two furniture pieces. Let me just turn down the ISO 
so that way you guys can see it so these are the, uh, both pieces that i purchased to, uh yesterday um i'm really really excited uh for these um because i i definitely need the storage like i really really do it's getting out of control in here <laughs> I, I i definitely don't like things just lingering all over the place i'm sorry guys let me turn this down um i think we should be got that there but yeah guys um great things are happening so um yeah guys i'm gonna finish up here really quickly and then we can get to going Alrighty, so i'll see you in a few what's good everyone what is good happy sunday friends it's february 11th um i haven't picked up the vlogging camera in a couple of days but nothing to report because i was just working at the uh, corporate job this week um you guys know um it's been a very fulfilling week for, as far as like news and just successes you know i'm just really really excited for this new chapter and i just can't believe that we're documenting it you know um i do want to also make a disclaimer because i did finish editing the vlog i saw a lot in the video i was looking up and i just wanted to make a disclaimer when i'm looking up i'm looking at my vision board my vision board is behind you guys so if i'm like doing this it's because i am constantly looking at my vision board because my vision board is so personal to me and it literally is my dream and you know one of the things that are on my vision board is literally connecting with God and a different journey it really really is and it's beautiful it's something that everybody has to experience on their own um, and yeah so I literally allow God to be the voice the loudest voice in my head and in my life so yes guys what time is it, it is it's 10 2 in the morning um, I haven't had no coffee yet so I'm gonna go ahead and make a cup of coffee with you guys and then um, I'm gonna show you guys how I set up to film for YouTube because today we are going to film I'm super excited you guys have been asking for a makeup tutorial for week well actually months now I haven't filmed a makeup tutorial since I think the end of November it's been a while so it's time um, I have a beautiful look in mind um, I'm definitely using uh, the Blend Bunnies palette. If you guys have never seen, um, I don't, on my vlogs, I don't get to really talk about makeup. So I'm actually going to show you guys what palette. Actually, let me bring you guys with me. Um, I forgot I have a new tripod so I can adjust it and stuff, which is dope. Um, yeah, so I love this. I love this, love this. Um, it looks a little overexposed because we're by the window. So let me just turn down the ISO a little bit. Yeah, I think we should be good here. Um, but let me show you guys the palette. Um, so I was between both of these palettes today. I was like, um, which one am I going to use? Which one am I going to use? Because I want to do a Valentine's Day kind of look. I definitely want to do something in the purpley pink family, but I still want to add an essence of Santos in it, if that makes sense. So if you guys have never seen palettes that I personally actually enjoy, this is um, one of the brands that I enjoy. This is Be Perfect Cosmetics. This is the Carnival uh, Interstellar palette, but come on, y'all. Can we just get into this? I haven't used this uh, palette in about, ooh, it's been a while. But look at these colors. Like, this is what literally has me in all awe. literally because it makes me want to create. But this is the Legendary Blend Bunnies palette. Like, I've used this tons of times on my, on my channel, but like, yeah baby you can't like <laughs> blend bunny is it okay so that's what i'm gonna be using in today's video um again i just want to do something really really pretty um but i want to do something artistry too i was thinking about um freaking putting gems on my my eyes too but anyways let me go ahead and make some coffee and then let me show you guys how i set up <laughs>
coffee is freaking steaming. Do you see how hot this is? Oh, yes. We talking about some hot ass coffee. Okay. Um, so I'm going to let this cool down really quickly before I burn my mouth. gonna set up now um, and I'm gonna show you guys how I set up for YouTube and then do not mind my beard um, I just uh, yesterday I gave myself um, some self love y'all also we got to talk about some products that I received yesterday before I actually close out on here because you know what let me actually do that right now um, I do not know if you guys have ever heard of salt air y'all I received my package first of all it took forever to get to my house but I think that it's worth it okay they have them at Target so this is what it looks like this is um, the actual body lotion this one is in the Soundtel bloom y'all this is all over TikTok and Instagram. I was like, what is this about? And also my friend, my influencer friend Danielle Blends lives by this stuff. So I was like, I have to try it. I really have to try it. First of all, the packaging, it is everything. That nude packaging is it's like literally giving. Um, I love this. My uh, Summer Fridays, like the color of this packaging is just everything. So if I could get a whole bunch of like nude stuff to like replace everything that's here, totally my vibe but that is not the point y'all let me tell y'all this right here oh my gosh the santel bloom smells really really good i think that is super unisex it has a great like musky scent that's just so like alluring but y'all right here this is where it's at pink motherfucking beach y'all this smells oh freaking amazing y'all yesterday i could not stop i could not stop so because i don't have the lotion what i did was i did um my regular jergens and then i went in with a little bit of the santel bloom y'all i put the oil this oil on y'all i was i was like wait a minute this is the oil i was like i was like y'all i literally couldn't stop i was like this I highly suggest this. I'm going to do a, a little body routine for you guys, and I'm going to use this. Also, I did pick up um, the Kaali, uh, what is this called? The Eden um, fragrance, y'all. This right here smells so good. Um, I will unbox this in our next vlog for you guys, but that also smells really good. But y'all, I'm not going to hold you. The salt air, I don't know why they don't carry the whole lineup at um, Target, but you need it you need it it smells so good <laughs> okay let me show you guys what i do to set up for youtube i do have a soft light here this is where i place the uh second one and then the first one is right here um so i'm going to adjust this uh panel and what was that oh um i'm gonna adjust this panel and then i'm gonna go ahead and move this panel right here and then i'll go ahead and set up my ring light so let me go ahead and do that really quickly all right guys i think that this is a good view i think you guys can see it i'm still on my sony zv1 so it's not like the widest view first what i like to do again is adjust the the, the panels but i'm gonna actually do that last um i'm gonna go ahead and take my tripod first and place it in the center um, obviously I've been using this tripod a lot more often than ever before so that's why it's higher than usual um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I level this light down um, when I am doing a makeup tutorial um, I like to keep absolutely closet and I like to push this as far close but still low enough so that way we're getting the background so I have to adjust the bottom one and I usually hover it like right where the computer is at. But I'm going to leave this one here. Uh, my ring light goes here in the middle. So let me show you guys. Do keep in mind my ring light is broke. Um, I, I have to replace this. It's so annoying. Mind you, like I don't even know how it broke because I barely use the bad boy. And then for the second light panel, which is behind you guys, I'm just going to go ahead and adjust it right on this side. I hope you guys can see. See, um, this is where I place it. This at, uh, yeah, you guys can see. So I go ahead and place this about here. Once everything is nice and adjusted, obviously you want to go ahead and plug everything to see that everything is working. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my lights. Okay, and then 
This needs to go straight over there. There we go. Alright, and that is very warm. I need it to be lit. There we go. Alright, I have to see this on the camera because I don't want overexposure, but for the most part, everything looks good. I'm going to bring this light up a little bit because I still see shadowing. Alright. I'm sorry, guys. You guys are overexposed now because it's very, very bright. Hold on. Let me just put on the ND filter for you guys at this point. Yes. There we go. This is what the lighting setup is. Everything back here is lit. So right now, what I'm going to do is that um, this light is on, so from the front, it looks very washed out because there's no um, amber lighting. So I'm going to go ahead and put on my desk light. So when you are looking from it, from the uh, front, front side, we have a little bit of warmthness from this side that kind of balances out the frame, okay? I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull out my camera. Um, my camera, I keep them stored right um, in this uh, little storage bin. And I keep my camera in here. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what my setup looks like. Here's where I store my camera. Uh, like everything to be safe. So literally safe. I have it in here, <laughs> okay? Um, so I have my battery. So I definitely have to pull this out because we are filming for long periods of time today. And then, of course, the bad boy, the production camera, <laughs> which is the Canon 90D. If you guys are wondering, this is what it looks like. This is the bad boy, the bad, bad, bad boy. I'm going to show you guys how I set it up now. I do have a dummy battery for my Sony ZV-1, which I am pulling out because I am going to be filming um, short form content on there and the adapter piece to power this bad boy up. So I think this is a good view to set you guys up. I hope you guys can see. So I'm, I do have a little um, holster here. Here, uh, that clips right into here and then you just tighten it let's go ahead and power this bad boy on I'll take off the lens cap all right let's see it's a little overexposed right now so I need to come down a little bit on the lighting all right I think that this is good so now we just got to set up the actual monitor and the mic for my monitor i do use an ipad pro mic i do go ahead and use um my blue yachty so when i am filming i just go ahead and put it to the side so i'm gonna go ahead and put that there so that way i can see myself um when you're doing a makeup tutorial it's super important to make sure that you're in focus so putting the monitor here ensures that i am always in focus the microphone which is the most important part honestly it's not even quality that's the most important part you want to make sure that your sound is good so that's why i spend a lot of money on equipment because it is so there's just certain elements to your videos that need to happen so i'm going to put my mic here now with this mic i have a audio uh, cable. So here is uh, the audio jack for the mic. Um, I do just plug this on the bottom and then I plug it up to the camera. Super easy. Plug this up to the mic. Now all we gotta do is just plug it onto the bottom and voila. That is good. You will do a mic check once we connect to the actual actually we should do that now when you are officially connected it should these two um boxes should light up so i'm going to go down to shooting mode and you guys are going to see me Ooh, you know um so here is what it looks like connected uh, i'm going to push the camera a little bit further back um because it's too close but um this is just a test we want to just make sure that we like how it is i it's it's way too close for me so i'm going to move it back Alrighty, so as you guys can see, this is a um, good distance. Um, I like how the frame is looking. Um, I'm actually, let me see if I could bring it down a little bit. E what is that? 100. I think I like 125. The mic is not connected. Something is wrong. Maybe. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so you guys see that the levels are moving. You got to check your audio, guys. Okay. 
um, but you also want to make sure that wherever you place it, it's not peaking. So if you see it go above the green line, then it's way too much. But I think that we're good here because I don't see myself peaking. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. So as long as it doesn't get into the red, you should be good. So the last thing I have to go ahead and do is uh, switch, the, well, set this camera up because again, I'm shooting for a uh, short form today. So give me one second. I'm gonna switch over to a different camera. Let's go ahead and set up my ZV-1. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this small tripod and I'm facing it towards end of the desk and what I'm gonna do is use this vertically because again I am filming for Instagram and TikTok so I'm gonna go ahead and put this here switch the screen here just make sure that I'm liking the way I'm set up so you want to make sure that you are properly in frame and properly exposed okay pretty much this is all set up um, I will be using a dummy battery to film um, I'm not gonna use the regular battery but I just wanted to make sure that we were in frame so this will allow me to uh, film for long periods for long hours because if you guys know you know filming a makeup tutorial especially one of my makeup tutorials is long okay so I'm gonna go ahead and set that up the last thing that I do when I am setting up to film is that I light up the background um, so I don't do that until I'm actually filming so I'm gonna actually go fi finish um, lining myself up and getting ready to film uh, but that's what I do last is uh, go ahead and put the lights on and the candles so pretty much that is it so let me give you guys a glimpse of how everything looks set up all right guys so this is how the setup looks from the back so here is the cannon okay and then of course we have the background here is my youtube setup um i know it is a tedious task but everything comes together at the end to create magic and i honestly wouldn't have it any other way um if you guys have any questions about any of the products that i use today do sound off in the comments below you guys know i'm here to educate and help we're going to wrap it up here i'm going to go get ready so that way i can film this look that you guys have been killing me for okay you guys know i try to deliver here's to our first uh look for the year 2024 is going to be okay <laughs> if you guys made it to the end of today's video thank you so much for tuning in we've been going through a lot y'all we've been going through a lot but all good things okay so do stay tuned for the ride because this year is going to be immaculate all right you guys so um if you haven't already hit that like button don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up do go follow me over on my instagram and tiktok i'll leave the handles right on the screen for you guys and in the description bar and you guys already know i will catch you guys in the next one later friends <laughs>